What's the single most important metric of any machine's output? You might think size, power, efficiency. Well, ultimately, it's uptime. If any given machine doesn't produce when you need it to, nothing else really matters. Modern mines have some of the largest, most powerful, and most meticulously engineered pieces of equipment on the planet, but maximizing uptime is absolutely critical to achieve the anticipated output. If you work in maintenance or reliability, you're going to be familiar with dirty oil. Particles, water, and varnish get into your oil systems causing premature oil changes, component failures, and unplanned downtime. Industrial operations such as mining and processing are inherently dirty, especially mobile equipment. Mining haul trucks are massively impressive, so it's hard to comprehend that dirt particles smaller than we can even see could be responsible for downtime. But as their size and capacity has increased over the years, so has the stress on the oil, which is responsible for keeping all those moving parts separated and lubricated. With tighter tolerances and increased loads, the need for clean oil has never been greater. Today I'd like to present how these three maintenance expenses, oil changes, overhauls, and downtime, are ripe to harvest significant savings. They all have exclusive benefits in and of themselves, yet they are all interconnected by a single commodity, oil. I'm going to show you how a maintenance program using good offline filtration can improve all three. Nobody plans to be wasteful, but in large operations, materials are too often wasted in the name of expediency. A single ultra-class haul truck uses over 4,000 liters of oil across its various systems. All of that oil is dumped and replaced during servicing because the truck reaches a certain number of operating hours or because the oil becomes dirty. But the oil's still good and that dirt can be filtered out. Some of the oils in a haul truck are filtered through the truck's own inline filters, but these filters are more concerned with letting large volumes of oil flow through them than they are with taking fine particles out. Even with these inline filters, the manufacturers recommend changing oil after every 2,000 hours of operation with mineral oils or twice that with expensive synthetics. Companies that employ a regular offline filtration regimen report savings in the millions of dollars. Now that sounds like a salesy number, but here's the facts as reported by our customers employing a proactive offline filtration strategy. By using offline filters at each planned maintenance, those oil drain intervals increase by five to seven times. For final drive oil, that's an average of 12,000 operating hours, and hydraulic oil, 24,000 hours. That's equivalent to saving 11,000 liters of oil per truck per year. When we factor in the costs of those various oils, that translates to $75,000 of savings. With offline filtration, the use of new oil plummets, not to mention the reduction in waste oil disposal. Mining is a tough environment, especially for mobile equipment that is out in the field. Saving oil is one thing, but the upshot of running super clean oil in the haul truck components is another thing entirely. The oil change intervals are set by manufacturers because as the oil gets dirty, the wear on the components accelerates and their life expectancy dwindles. Keeping the oil cleaner for longer limits that wear and extends the component life. If we look at differentials, typical overhauls occur every 12,000 hours. Our customers have reported on average those rebuilds are extended to 24,000 hours. For final drives, they've gone from 18,000 to 36,000 hours. That effectively cuts the number of overhauls in half. And with a rebuild cost upwards of $100,000 per final drive, that works out to another $8,000 in annual savings per truck. Extended rebuilds combined with reduced use of oil adds up to $83,000 of savings. Downtime, and especially unplanned downtime, can easily be the most expensive setback for mining operations. Every haul truck is purchased in order to maintain a certain flow of raw materials to the processing plant and interrupt... <clears throat> and interruptions disrupt this vital flow. 
Cost and loss in productivity can be difficult to calculate, but some mines estimate their processing disruptions at close to $300,000 per hour, so the stakes are considerable. Not all downtime is avoidable, but gains from these improved maintenance practices are reducing the cost per operating hour. According to some customer estimates, this would equate to another $17,000 per truck, bringing the total savings to $100,000 each year just by filtering the various oils at each PM instead of dumping it. Let's look at a fleet of 60 haul trucks like we see in some of Canada's mines and the potential savings are upwards of six million dollars with reduced oil usage over 640,000 liters. With the increased focus on environmental impact, efficiency and reliability, mining operations can experience significant gains by treating the oil with the respect it deserves and demands. Implementing the use of kidney loop offline filtration systems as part of your preventative maintenance strategy, you have the opportunity to reduce your oil demands run your trucks longer between overhauls, and ultimately achieve better uptime for your fleet.